Unlocking the bootloader for OnePlus 7 Pro does not require any special code from OnePlus, but it does guarantee that your warranty will be void. So it's always better to wait until the warranty gets over. So hi guys, my name is Jarvis and in this video I will guide you how you can unlock the bootloader of OnePlus 7 Pro. So guys, as you can see this is my OnePlus 7 Pro and I'm gonna unlock the bootloader of this device and currently Android version is Android 11. Now it is time to enable the developer option. So uh, to enable developer option tap on build number 5 time and it shows you, uh, you are now developer. Now go back and go to system and here is the developer option. So open this and here you need to enable OEM unlocking. Uh, as you can see my device is not unlocked yet so you need to enable this and now uh, enable auto reboot and enable USB debugging option and click on OK. Now it's time to boot a device into bootloader mode. So I'm gonna boot the device into bootloader. So as you can see my device is now booted into bootloader and the device state is unlocked. It's mean my device bootloader is locked yet. Uh, so it's time to move to the PC screen. So in PC you need to download these two files. First is ADB file and another is OnePlus USB driver folder. So you need to extract the oneplus driver folder. File is now extracted. Now open the folder and here you need to run this file as administrator. So I'm gonna run it. And click on OK and click on install and it will install the oneplus USB drivers in your system so driver are now installed now go back now it's time to install adb setup file so install this file So guys as you can see adb is now installed now it's time to unlock the bootloader so open command prompt by entering cmd in the address bar here type fastboot devices to check your device is connected or not so type fastboot devices and hit enter as you can see my device is connected now type fastboot oem unlock as soon as the command is executed your phone should display a confirmation prompt on the screen so guys as you can see the confirmation prompt on the device now you need to select unlock the bootloader option so press volume down key to select the unlock the bootloader option and press power key to continue and it will wipe all your data so guys that's it with the unlock of the bootloader and your device should automatically reboot in the operating system and you will see the unlock bootloader message warning during the initial boot process uh, this is a mandatory warning and, and completely normal so wait until the device will boots up. My device is now boots up. So it's time to check the device bootloader is unlocked or not. So go to about phone and you need to enable the developer option first. Developer option is now enabled. Now open developer options. So guys here as you can see uh, bootloader is already unlocked. It means my device bootloader is unlocked. Now you need to enable advanced reboot. And it's time to boot the device into bootloader mode again. Now in the PC you need to download these two files, first is twrp zip file and another is twrp image file. Uh, you need to download this file from the description link and 
here in CMD you need to type fastboot devices to check again your device is connected uh, so my device is connected now type fastboot boot space and here you need to give the address of your twrp image file so i'm gonna paste here and now hit enter and your device will boot into the fastboot mode So guys my device is now booted into Tidal Warp Recovery. First time it may take time so wait and guys tap here and swipe to remove the warning. Now Tidal Warp Recovery is not permanently installed we need to install it. So tap on advance and tap on flash current Tidal Warp and swipe to confirm. It will install the uh, Tidal Warp Recovery permanently. Guys uh, until the Tidal Warp will install I am gonna copy the magix file from PC to phone. So I am gonna copy this magix file and paste in my device. Now TWRP recovery is already installed. So go back and tap on install and here select magix file and swipe to confirm flash. Guys magix flashing might take quite a while so wait. So magix is now installed. Now tap on wipe, tap on format data, type yes and hit enter. It will wipe all the data. Now here tap on reboot and tap on recovery. It will boot the device into recovery mode again. guys device is booted into recovery mode it means TWR recovery is permanently installed so tap on reboot and tap on system and this will reboot the device into operating system uh, guys first boot might take quite a while but don't worry it's normal so wait until it will boot into the system So guys my device is now booted successfully uh, it's time to check my device is rooted or not so uh, i need to update magix apk so i'm gonna download it and install it magix apk is now installed so guys as you can see magix manager is now successfully installed on the device the magix version is, is 24.1 and guys by this way you can install TWRP recovery and root your oneplus 7 pro guys let me show you TWRP recovery is permanently installed or not so i am gonna boot my device into a fast boot mode so guys yes as you can see TWRP recovery is permanently installed so uh, i hope you like this video if you like this video give it a big thumbs up don't forget to subscribe to the channel thank you for watching tech jarvis